Okay, um, I have my own problems, but this isn't about me because I kind of like the guy, like just complete bitch bucket. But anyway, <laughs> did you say bitch bucket? Yes. <laughs> I really like that. I like that one as much as I accept. <laughs> okay, let's get to now with my lexicon. Okay, this um, one is called the bitch bucket. <laughs> yes, it is. But, but it's not about me. My little sister, she just started seventh grade, I believe. Yeah. Um, but she, in her sixth grade year, she fell in love with this guy, but, uh, all this stuff happened, but that's, that's the point. Um, <laughs> she found out he was cheating on her by going into the girl's bathroom and he was giving head to another guy. <laughs> Where are these boys that are not sure of their sexuality and experience? Is everyone that's experienced this in Las Vegas? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I, 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 I are you looking for advice or you just wanted to tell us that? No, I was looking for advice. For those of you in this room who are under 18, head means map pencils. Uh, he had a project due later that day. And then, uh, very very useful sometimes. The test. And then her second boyfriend, she found out, well, he was behind everyone's back going out with everyone in their little group. And no one found out until the Halloween dance. Whoa! I bet the Halloween dance was crazy. <laughs> the title of this just changed to Total Pimp. <laughs> Break up with him. Break up. Oh no, they're already gone. They're oh, not any. So she. Oh, she. She, she was kicked his ass. Oh, oh, oh okay. well, she already did it. Our advice to her is um, wear brass knuckles next time. Okay. <laughs> okay. I had a boyfriend, of course, obviously. Um, Congratulations. <laughs> Um, about two months before last year's anime Vegas, he said, Oh, I don't love you as much anymore. I'm in love with one of your friends. Ouch. Oh. That's not the worst part. Oh. At anime Vegas last year, she was like getting really emotional about it, just how he had hopped from me to her instantly. She almost tried killing him with her claws. Yes. Killing you or killing him? No, killing him. Wow. It gets worse. So they break up. And he's still like, okay, you know, blah. He ends up going with another girl at Anime Vegas. Within this one, or the three-day convention. And now he's doing some girl in the UK. <laughs> Long-distance relationship. <laughs> oh. Wow. Uh, <laughs> does this, wait, does this go on a lot at anime conventions? It, it seems like it. It seems like it. So. I would, I would, I would say chill out on the dating anime Vegas people. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe not the best for you. Cool. Everybody else seems to have better luck. Curlin and Android 18 at the back. Uh, Happy uh, marriage. Yay!
or Will Smith. <laughs> Hello. Hello. There is one story when I was in sixth, eighth, seventh grade. Yeah. And my friend, well, I'm now eighth, but my friend was going out with this guy that got beat up a lot, which is right there. She's right there. Right there. She's not embarrassed at all by you pointing at her. No, Woo! she's not. Not really. Come here. Oh, come here. This is her. Hi. 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 Her name is Kat. Hi, Kat. Hi, Kat. And well, she was going out with it, and he's all like, woohoo, now I'm not going to get beat up anymore. Woohoo. And so, then I was in his class in second and third grade, and he was all hanging out with this girl, all look like they're holding hands, sitting on the same seat. So I was going out with each other. And so I told her, so she broke up with him. And he's all like, no. <laughs> that yeah. He got me up. yeah, he got me up. <laughs> yeah, and um, well. Everyone chill. And this year, he wants to go out with her again. And she keeps on saying no, and he won't stop bugging her about it. Mm. So what's your advice for her? My advice is don't go out with him. Don't go out. Unless you really like him. <laughs> Does he have good abs? <laughs> oh, man. So remarkably he looks very, consistent. <laughs> he looks like a hippie. Literally. Wow. He looks like a what? He's a hippie. A hippie. 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 So is he your type? No. Well, then don't go out with him. <gasps> There's no question. You like anyway. Here's the thing. If you want to go out with somebody, don't forget to go out with him. Yeah, forget what it <laughs> Unless they're your like, best friend and they like want to go out with you and you're like, okay, I'm going to try because you're my friend. Yeah. But that can be awkward because then sometimes you're not friends anymore. Staying alone when you have the opportunity to date somebody you don't particularly like is still valid because that means that you could come across somebody during that time that you would actually be interested in. It also means that you're growing as a person, yourself, alone, which is awesome. And, and helps yourself. you find people later who you will be better friends with. Exactly. How many of us here are single? Woo! If you don't care if it's going to be a serious relationship, you might as well just get somebody you're attracted to because it's fun. I object on that. <laughs> <laughs> right. This is more of a fan question. I have a friend I've been friends with since middle school. And lately it seems like the only reason why she even wants to get in contact with me anymore is because she wants something. Ooh. But whenever like, I need her or anything, she kind of just drops off the face of the earth. Yeah. That's an excellent yeah. question. I don't know if I should stay friends with her because of the long history or just kind of... I would tell her how you feel. Yeah, absolutely. And I'd let her know that it's not working for you this way and that you need her to be a friend to you, like you're being a friend to her. And if she's not up for it, that's when you... Right, then you know that it's not worth it. If she knows that you have a problem with it and she is not correcting it, then that means the friendship yeah. is not worth it. She might not realize it, so that's why you need to tell her. Thank you very much. You're welcome.